To keep the location of the bees a secret, we'll be showing you this adventure from the crossing of the river. Glasgow is the owner of g -Lynx Honey. His intention is to work along with other beekeepers of Grenada to improve distribution and marketing of this Grenadian treasure. Now there's a velcro in the flap right, that you're pinning. Because it was rainy today, um, I brought some fire starter materials. Again, it's part of the project recycle initiative, right? So an interesting use for some cheap paper from the office. Smoker, we have a nice clear plume of white smoke that works well to calm the bees is the word that's used. Um, while you're decked in white, in Grenada you will find a common practice among the keepers is to improvise. That's the way because we have to watch the costs of operating. The keeping is actually an expensive exercise. Well, I see you you choose the color blue instead of red. It um, makes a lot of sense, right? <laughs> yes, it's a, it's a neutral color. <laughs> And Project Recycle says I make use of a, what would have been discarded as an old fencing. <laughs> And I feel as secure as you are behind your wetsuit. That's wise. <laughs> All right, we'll go to one of the boxes right here. Well, I have to tell you, Mr. Glasgow, this is the first time I'm going into a beehive. Well, so I, there's a little bit of apprehension, but no, no. There's no need to be. Not what I have here are very calm bees. Mm -hmm. um, they are the aggressive kind that would have spot you all the way down by the river yeah. and charged at you. Right. What are my precautions going into the hive? Right. Going into the hive here, you stand behind me, stand behind the smoke, observe and stay calm. Very well, sir. All right. This set has been a pretty fast group of builders. All right. So we apply a, a little smoke to calm them, you hear them buzzing. All right. This is a nice, healthy hive. Typically, not with the cover to get off the bees. We operate with a little caution because we don't want to crush, especially our queen bee. Yeah, this would have been the last frame I added. Yeah, we take it out with care. And as you can see, it has a very nice color. All right. They basically built it, built out. You would see when we did, did the earlier demonstration of the empty box that we started with a frame that was flat. Right? The process of building has begun and is going pretty nicely. They filled this frame um, on one side completely and they started working on. What's on the this composition side. of this hive? Uh, these would be all workers there. Uh, well, we we would have a variety of these in the hive, right? Um, of course, we have the primary mother of all, that is the queen bee. Mm -hmm. uh, there and there'll be one Typically, queen there's bee one queen bee in the hive. Mm -hmm. right? Then we have some males called drones. Um, they're the lazy boys. They're only there for good looks. They like the playboys. Right? 
and then all the work is done by the smaller worker bees right? uh, some of them uh, forage in the field some of them will be busy uh, doing the tending to the housekeeping mm -hmm. so they clean up on the inside huh? These guys are in control in this environment. They work with nature and we simply cooperate with them to be able to give them the attention they need, control the mites, control the pests, mm -hmm. right? And provide the optimal environment so that they could give us that sweet treat. Now it was Mervyn's turn to get his hands dirty. Are you checking it out? Are you talking about looking? Obviously, he didn't know the type of cameraman he was dealing with. Not want to be out then, I also took a turn.